Welcome back to Click Future, where your future is just a click away. Today we're talking about a technology that's so revolutionary, so fundamentally different from anything we've ever built, that it will make our current internet look like smoke signals. The quantum internet isn't just a faster version of what we have now that harnesses the strangest properties of quantum mechanics to create communication networks that are literally unhackable. And here's the thing that will blow your mind. It's not science fiction anymore. The first quantum internet networks are already operational, and within the next decade, quantum communication will begin replacing traditional internet infrastructure in ways that will transform everything from banking and healthcare to national security and personal privacy. Albert Einstein famously called quantum entanglement spooky action at a distance. But what's truly spooky is how this phenomenon is about to revolutionize human communication. Today, we're going to explore how the quantum internet works, why it's absolutely unhackable, and what this means for a world where digital privacy and security have become more important than ever. By the end of this video, you'll understand not just the science behind quantum communication, but why this technology represents the most significant advancement in information transmission since the invention of the telegraph. The quantum internet isn't just coming, it's here and it's about to change everything. To understand why the quantum internet is so revolutionary, every piece of information you send online, your emails, your banking transactions, your private messages, travels through networks that are inherently insecure. When you send a message over the traditional internet, that information is broken down into packets of data that travel through multiple servers, routers, and networks before reaching their destination. At every step of this journey, your data can potentially be intercepted, copied, or modified without you ever knowing it happened. Our current security relies on encryption, mathematical algorithms that scramble your data in ways that are extremely difficult for classical computers to decode. But here's the terrifying reality. These encryption methods are based on mathematical problems that are hard for today's computers to solve, not impossible. A sufficiently powerful computer or a breakthrough in mathematical algorithms could potentially break any encryption system we currently use. And we're not just talking about theoretical threats. Nation states, criminal organizations, and even individual hackers are constantly developing new methods to break encryption, intercept communications, and steal sensitive information. Every day, Billions of dollars are lost to cybercrime, and countless individuals have their privacy violated through digital surveillance and data breaches. But there's an even more fundamental problem, the very act of copying digital information. When you send a traditional message, copies of that message exist on multiple servers and networks. Even if the message is encrypted, those copies can be stored indefinitely and potentially decrypted in the future when more powerful computers become available. Neil deGrasse Tyson has pointed out that the universe itself seems designed to protect quantum information in ways that classical information simply cannot be protected. This is the key insight that makes the quantum internet possible. Quantum mechanics provides security guarantees that are based on the fundamental laws of physics, not just mathematical complexity. The quantum internet solves these problems in ways that seem almost magical but are actually based on the deepest principles of quantum mechanics. It creates communication channels that are not just extremely difficult to hack, they're physically impossible to hack without detection. The quantum internet is based on a phenomenon that Einstein found so disturbing he spent years trying to prove it was impossible. Quantum entanglement. When two particles become entangled, they form a connection that transcends space and time. Measuring one particle instantly affects the other, no matter how far apart they are. This isn't just theory. It's been demonstrated in laboratories around the world and is now being used to create the first quantum communication networks. When you want to send a quantum message, you create pairs of entangled particles. You keep one particle and send the other to your intended recipient. Because these particles are entangled, any change you make to your particle is instantly reflected in the recipient's particle. But here's where it gets really interesting. Quantum mechanics has a built-in security feature called the no-cloning theorem. 
His fundamental principle states that it's impossible to create a perfect copy of an unknown quantum state. Unlike classical information, which can be copied infinitely without degradation, quantum information cannot be duplicated. This means that if someone tries to intercept your quantum message, they can't just copy it and pass it along. Any attempt to observe or measure quantum information changes it in detectable ways. It's like having a message written in ink that disappears the moment someone other than the intended recipient tries to read it. Brian Greene, the theoretical physicist, has explained this beautifully. Quantum communication doesn't just protect your information, it makes the very act of eavesdropping physically impossible without detection. The universe itself becomes your security system. The process works like this. When you want to send a secure message, you first establish a quantum key using entangled particles. This key is generated through quantum processes that are fundamentally random and cannot be predicted or reproduced. You and your recipient use this quantum key to encrypt your message using traditional methods. But because the key itself is quantum protected, the entire communication becomes unhackable. If anyone tries to intercept the quantum key during transmission, the entanglement is broken and both parties immediately know that the communication has been compromised. It's like having a security system that not only prevents break-ins, but also tells you exactly when someone has tried to break in. The quantum internet isn't just a theoretical concept, it's already being built and deployed around the world. China has constructed a quantum communication network spanning over 2,000 kilometers, connecting Beijing and Shanghai with quantum encrypted communication links. This network is already being used for secure government and financial communications. The European Union has launched the Quantum Internet Alliance, a massive research initiative aimed at building a continent-wide quantum communication network. Network. Universities and research institutions across Europe are already connected through quantum links and commercial applications are beginning to emerge. In the United States, companies like IBM, Google, and Microsoft are developing quantum communication technologies while government agencies are investing billions in quantum research and infrastructure. The National Science Foundation has announced plans for a national quantum internet that will connect research institutions, government facilities, and eventually commercial networks. But perhaps most impressively, satellite-based quantum communication is already operational. China's Mises satellite has demonstrated quantum communication between ground stations separated by thousands of kilometers, proving that quantum networks can span continents and even reach into space. These early quantum networks are primarily used for key distribution, creating and sharing the quantum keys that enable secure classical communication. But researchers are already working working on more advanced applications that will enable true quantum communication, where the messages themselves are transmitted in quantum states. Jana Levin, the cosmologist and quantum theorist, has observed that we're witnessing the birth of a new form of communication that's as different from the classical internet as the internet was from the telegraph. The implications are staggering. The performance of these early quantum networks is already impressive. Quantum key distribution can be performed at rates of millions of keys per second, enabling real-time secure communication for high bandwidth applications. The security is absolute. Any attempt at interception is immediately detected and the communication can be terminated before any information is compromised. While unhackable communication is the most obvious application of the quantum internet, it's just the beginning. Quantum networks will enable entirely new forms of computation and information processing that are impossible with classical systems. Quantum cloud Cloud computing represents one of the most exciting possibilities. Instead of accessing classical computers over the internet, you'll be able to access quantum computers through quantum networks. This will democratize access to quantum computing power, allowing anyone to solve problems that are currently impossible for classical computers. Imagine being able to simulate molecular interactions for drug discovery, optimize complex logistics problems, or perform advanced artificial intelligence computations using 
quantum algorithms, all through your connection to the quantum internet. Small businesses, researchers, and even individuals will have access to computational capabilities that are currently available only to the largest corporations and government agencies. The quantum internet will also enable distributed quantum computing, where multiple quantum computers work together on the same problem. Because quantum information can be shared through entanglement, quantum computers separated by thousands of miles can function as a single, more powerful system. This could lead to quantum supercomputers with capabilities far beyond what any single quantum computer could achieve. Financial services will be revolutionized by quantum communication. Banks and financial institutions will be able to conduct transactions with absolute security, knowing that their communications cannot be intercepted or manipulated. High-frequency trading, international transfers, and sensitive financial data will all be protected by quantum encryption that's based on the laws of physics rather than mathematical complexity. Healthcare applications are particularly promising. Medical records, genetic information, and sensitive health data can be transmitted with complete privacy. Telemedicine consultations can be conducted with the knowledge that patient information is absolutely secure. Research collaborations between medical institutions can share sensitive data without privacy concerns. Charles Liu, the astrophysicist and science communicator, has noted that quantum communication will enable forms of collaboration and information sharing that are simply impossible today. When you can share information with absolute security, it changes what kinds of problems you can solve together. The quantum internet will also enable new forms of scientific collaboration. Researchers around the world will be able to share sensitive data, coordinate experiments, and collaborate on projects with complete confidence in the security of their communications. This could accelerate scientific discovery in ways we can barely imagine. The development of quantum internet infrastructure has become a new form of technological competition between nations. Countries that master quantum communication first will have significant advantages in national security, economic competitiveness, and technological sovereignty. China's early lead in quantum communication has prompted massive investments from other nations. The United States has announced the National Quantum Initiative, a multi-billion dollar program to develop quantum technologies, including communication networks. The European Union has launched Quantum Flagship, a 1 billion euro research program focused on quantum technologies. The stakes are enormous because quantum communication isn't just about security. It's about maintaining technological independence in an increasingly connected world. Countries with advanced quantum networks will be able to protect their sensitive communications from foreign surveillance, while potentially gaining the ability to access classical communications from countries that haven't adopted quantum protection. This has led to what some experts call the quantum divide, a potential future where countries with quantum communication capabilities can communicate securely among themselves, while countries without these capabilities remain vulnerable to surveillance and cyber attacks. Elon Musk has warned that the quantum internet will create a new form of digital sovereignty. Countries that don't develop these capabilities will find themselves at a permanent disadvantage in the digital realm. This has prompted even smaller nations to invest in quantum research and seek partnerships with quantum advanced countries. The race isn't just between countries, it's also between companies. Tech giants like IBM, Google, Microsoft, and Amazon are all developing quantum communication technologies, recognizing that quantum networks will be essential infrastructure for the digital economy of the future. Despite its revolutionary potential, the quantum internet faces significant technical challenges. Quantum states are extremely fragile and can be disrupted by environmental factors like temperature fluctuations, electromagnetic interference, and even cosmic radiation. Building quantum networks that can operate reliably in real-world conditions requires solving engineering problems that push the boundaries of current technology. Distance is another major challenge. Quantum signals degrade over distance much more rapidly than classical signals. While classical internet signals can travel thousands of miles through fiber optic cables, quantum signals typically lose their quantum properties after a few hundred kilometers. This requires the development of quantum repeaters, devices that can extend quantum communication over long distances without destroying the quantum properties of the information. 
Cost is also a significant barrier. Current quantum communication equipment is extremely expensive and requires specialized facilities and expertise to operate. Making quantum communication accessible to businesses and eventually consumers will require dramatic reductions in cost and complexity. Integration with existing internet infrastructure presents another challenge. The quantum internet won't replace the classical internet overnight. Instead, it will need to work alongside existing networks providing quantum security for the most sensitive communications while classical networks continue to handle routine traffic. There are also questions about standardization and interoperability. Different countries and companies are developing quantum communication technologies using different approaches and protocols, creating global standards that allow different quantum networks to communicate with each other will be essential for realizing the full potential of the quantum internet. The quantum internet is being deployed in phases, starting with the most critical applications and gradually expanding to broader use cases. Government and military communications are already using quantum encryption in some countries. Financial institutions are beginning to adopt quantum key distribution for their most sensitive transactions. Within the next five years, we can expect to see quantum communication networks connecting major cities in developed countries. These networks will primarily serve government agencies, financial institutions, and large corporations that require the highest levels of security. By 2030, quantum communication is likely to become available to smaller businesses and organizations, particularly those handling sensitive data like healthcare providers, legal firms, and research institutions. The cost and complexity of quantum communication equipment should decrease significantly during this period. Consumer access to quantum computing will probably begin in the 2030s, starting with premium services for individuals who require maximum privacy and security. Eventually, quantum protection may become a standard feature of internet service, just as encryption is today. The full realization of the quantum internet with quantum cloud computing, distributed quantum processing, and seamless integration with classical networks will likely take several decades, but the foundation is being built now, and the early applications are already demonstrating the transformative potential of quantum communication. The quantum internet represents more than just a new technology. It's a fundamental shift in how we think about information, privacy, and security. For the first time in human history, we're building communication networks that are protected by the laws of physics themselves, not just mathematical complexity. This technology will reshape everything from international relations and economic competition to personal privacy and scientific collaboration. The countries, companies, and individuals who understand and adopt quantum communication early will have significant advantages in the digital economy of the future. The quantum internet is here, and it's already beginning to change the world. The question isn't whether quantum communication will transform our digital infrastructure, it's how quickly we can build the networks, develop the technologies, and train the people necessary to realize its full potential. Thanks for watching Click Future, where your future is a click away. If the quantum internet fascinates or concerns you, share your thoughts in the comments below. Subscribe for more insights into the technologies that are reshaping our world. The future is quantum, and it's arriving faster than most people realize.